Okay, in this video, I'm going to be uh, looking into this question that I've got in front of me. And uh, I'm going to start off by looking at the coefficient of the x squared variable, which is always what you should be doing in a uh, complete square problem. In completing the square, your goal is to create a perfect square trinomial, which is why you complete the square. And you cannot do that if the uh, variable uh, coefficient the coefficient of the x squared variable is not 1. So if it's not 1, you've got to divide that term in front of the x squared variable uh, into each of the terms you have in your question. But seeing in our case the uh, variable in front of the x squared term is 1, you can proceed to actually completing the square by moving 4 right of the uh, equal sign to get the following. Now, I left a gap here because we're going to add some number. Okay, so there is going to be a number whereby 12 is divided by 2 and squared. Okay, and we know that number will also be added right of the equal sign. And we know that to be 36. Now, if we simplify it, we get x squared plus 12x plus 36 being equal to 32. Now, I'm going to factorize this to create a perfect square trinomial and you will get 6 plus x squared being equal to 32. Now, how I got 6 is by dividing the x term by 2, the variable in front of the x term by 2, and that's always the case. Okay, so now to solve for x, we we undo the square term by square rooting both sides and you will be left with x plus 6 plus or minus square root of 32 and it's simple from here. Uh, negative 6 will go right of the equal sign and you'll be left with uh, square root of 32. And this can be uh, further simplified to negative 6 plus or minus uh, 4 square root 2. And what I did here is pull it down to its primes from the square root of 32 to 4 root 2. You can always check it by putting 4 back into the square root sign. So just a check. Uh, putting 4 inside the square root, you will get under the square root 4 by 4 by 2, and you will get square root 32, which is what you got here. So you know that to be correct.